and it's filthy and freaking nasty. Oh my gosh, it just makes me like literally just like say, I can't do it. <laughs> Hi, you guys, and uh, welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad you guys are here, and you know, today's have been a really good day. I went to work. I, as you guys see in that clip before, I went to this restaurant. Oh my gosh. And it more was like more like a pub restaurant. So I just went in there to check out the menu um, to see what they had. I haven't told you guys, this is more like a sit down and chit chat with me, but I haven't told you guys that uh, I'm going to do a low carb, um, I'm not going to say diet, but a low carb life ch lifestyle. Uh, lifestyle change and I'm just looking for different ways I'm on YouTube looking for different like you know um, foods that I can try when I'm on my whole low carb lifestyle which will be the whole month of July which today is July 1st and I'm not going to even like lie to you guys I had messed up and I went and got a bagel at the bagel shop and but I didn't feel bad about it because I had them to scoop it out, thin it, and then toast it. And when I got my sandwich, it was like, it didn't taste like any bread there. So I, I don't feel ridiculous bad, but I feel bad because, you know, today is, you know, low carb. And, you know, I'm kind of just, like, me personally, I jump in everything. I don't even try to, like, research or anything like that. I only research when I'm basically in the low carb stage of the diet, you know, of the lifestyle change. But yes, I had for breakfast, I just had like a normal egg white bagel sandwich, thinned out, scooped out, all that good stuff with um, a bit of uh, a veggie cream cheese, which is garden veggie cream cheese, and it's a reduced fat. And I had like a turkey sausage patty, so that filled me up. Then for lunch, I think I had maybe, what did I have for lunch? That's the question because I don't remember having lunch. I think I had, well, actually, I don't think I had lunch, you know, and I'm not even hungry. Like, I don't know why I'm not hungry, and it's dinner time now, but I think for lunch I had, like, a, um, a LaCroix or a LaCroix um, spritz of water at Tom Thumb. I think you guys saw, like, where I took you guys. I told you guys jump in the basket because we were going on a little shopping trip. But our clearance there is like crazy. Like we have, uh, they got LaCroix for like 25 cents. They got LaCroix in a box, like in their own like 24 pack for like a dollar and some change. So I had to go ahead and hit them up and get some of that. But I had like one of those drinks with some blueberries added. And then I crushed up some ice. And then I put it in my little to-go bottle. Um, and put it in the freezer until it's time for me to, you know, use it. But it was so good, you guys. Like, just like a spritzel of water. It was just really, really good and refreshing. And I think because I've been taking my multivitamin, like, I think my multivitamin has something to do with my eating. But I know I'm supposed to eat, like, at least three times a day. And I'm supposed to snack twice. But I, I do not like snacking. I do not like snacking for nothing. You know what I mean? So... Um, I'm really glad that I'm decluttering my house because I've come up, I was stumbling up on stuff I just forgot I had and that's the good thing about decluttering your home because you're finding things that like you once bought but you don't even know where it happened to them. Like it's a whole different year and I'm finding stuff that I bought last year. So, um, even, I think I bought these this year, these little, um, cups, these little on-the-go snack cups, so what I'm going to do with this is probably add some fruit, and then some um, sunflower seeds, and have that maybe as a snack, I'm going to start trying to eat snacks, because um, I know that I am not doing good at snack eating, and uh, I found, ran across this things to do list thing, I really need this, so I can go ahead and start organizing things and putting things back together and all that good stuff like what's my next test the day you know of and then um i found you guys i found my um bath and body works home scents um which is this was the fresh cut lily um lilic 
or lilies, I think, lilacs. Yeah, Lilax, Fresh Cut, Lilax. I'll put it in the description box below, or if you can see this. But, you guys, I am not on my, my camera camera today. I am on my phone because I just didn't want to bring my camera here and get it broken and then have to buy no new one. But I just wanted to be safe, and so I left it at Mom's, and I'm just on my phone today. So, if... Anything look blurry, just know I'm on my phone. But I found this, and I bought this like a year ago. So I'm going to start using this like as soon as possible. You guys, like I'm not trying to put my business out there or whatever, but I'm going to say this. Like, um, I know I had money like saved or whatever, but I didn't know where I put it. <laughs> and I know I put it in like a jar or something because I normally like, like, I don't leave money laying around in my house, so don't get me wrong or whatever. And if you do that, that's fine, but at least have it in a safe box. But me, I was just trying to save money, like, real quick, like, like quick. And I literally forgot that I had money in a jar at my house. So, girl, on those, those struggle days, you know, on those rainy, do those rainy days, me and AJJ can, you know, have us a nice mommy and me day and go to, you know, our favorite spot is Slosky's. So we'll go to Slosky's and he'll have a kid's meal. I have a mommy meal and we're having fun. And I don't have to pay money out of bill money for us to eat, you know what I mean? Or on those days when we need food, I have extra money saved up. So, I, like I said, this is like more like a rainy day <laughs> fun. And I'm so excited that I found it because you guys. I didn't even know where I put it. Like, I knew I put it in, like, a basket. But when I went to the basket, it wasn't there. So, you know, I just, you know, I thank God for that because, like, the struggle is real out here, you know. Also, once I started losing weight, like, losing all this water weight, just losing it, um, I couldn't afford to get back into these shoes. Um, these are brand new shoes. Like, when I first bought them, um... Um, yeah, when I first bought these shoes, these shoes, like, could fit. Like, they was so cute on my feet. But now, like, my my feet is so swollen, like, water weight, and especially having diabetes and stuff like that, you do get a lot of water weight on you. So, my feet, like, hangs off of this, and it's embarrassing. I'm not going to go out stepping out like that. And I just, you know, for me, and we're just talking about, you know, life decluttering and stuff like this. And it's, girl, it has really opened my eyes to, like, all the money I have wasted. Like, even, like, to be honest, um, I waste a lot of money at 99 cent only stores. I waste a lot of money at Dollar Tree stores. My mom has actually told me this, like... Um, from the jump, like, why are you buying all this stuff? You know you have storage. You know you have stuff in my house. You know you had those same items, but you're constantly buying the same stuff. Which she wasn't lying because I love my mama deeply. And sometimes, you know, as, as kids, like, I'm a grown woman, but I'm just saying as kids of my, like, being my mama's child, we don't listen until into the day of, you know what I mean, like, I listen to my mama, but then sometimes I'm just like, yeah, right, mama, like, I'm not gonna find two of those, I'm not gonna find three of those, when I really did find two and three of those, so, mama, if you're watching, you were right, I shouldn't have spent so much money on the same items, so, um, what I'm gonna do is try to make a list of the stuff that I buy from Dollar Tree or 99, but I did tell you guys, I am taking a little break from that, from that, um, for a minute, like, maybe after July, I'll go back and start, um, definitely going back to Dollar Tree 99, but I'm gonna set a budget where I don't have to buy the same thing, so I'm just gonna constantly, like, most of the time I write stuff down, but this time I'm gonna be so serious about it, I'm not gonna say, I, oh, I forgot my list, because if I forget my list, then I'm gonna turn around and go back, and who wants to waste, you know, gas, or, you know, anybody's time that you're going to go shop with. So, if I forget my list, then I won't buy a thing. You know what I mean? I would not buy a thing because I would be going off budget. But, um, if I bring my list, I'll definitely get what's on my list. And that's it. So, moving forward. Now that I'm 
and decluttering and seeing everything that I have in my house, I am definitely um, surprised, you guys, because I've been working at this de whole declutter. You guys, my wig just sitting here chilling. <laughs> it's just like, okay, I'm in the pictures. It's, you know, it's my time to shine. But, um, yes, you guys. And then I found these little things here, little carpet things or whatever. Um, I'm probably going to do something with this. But some of the stuff that um, I'm finding, I'm definitely going to donate. And then some of the stuff that, like, I found in my clothes some busted, um, some, um, something busted, like, wasting on my clothes. Um, and I think it was, like, bath soap or something like that. It must have got too hot in the clothes and it busted. So, I'm going to trash that because it got all over my clothes. And now my clothes are smelling really good and fresh and so clean. And I like it. But I'm sorry I have to wash it all off. But anywho, you guys. How are you doing today? Enough of my talk. How are you doing today? Let me know in the comments below. Um, how are you doing? And um, again, when are you going to start decluttering? And I'm shouting out to that girl, Nikki. I'm, Nikki, girl, get it, get it, get it. You better get it done. Get it done because we got this. We can do this. You got to, you know, find a day where you're not doing anything and just go through and sort and sort and get it done because this is like to be honest like sis this is this is some dangerous stuff decluttering and stuff like that I almost fell like two or three times I girl I almost got stabbed by a knife because it fell out the cabinet because I didn't know it was there girl I, it's just so much stuff and I'm so happy because I'm actually sitting Are y'all still there? Okay. So, yeah. Um, I almost dropped the phone. But I'm actually sitting on my couch. Are y'all sitting? I'm sitting on my couch. So, I'm really, I'm really, like, feeling good about this. And then, also, you guys, I'm going to tell you, like, I told people on my Fitbit. Because, um, on my Fitbit, like, my Fitbit, um, site, like, I told them, I said, the color, the color, Decluttering is also a way to drop a few pounds. You know what I'm saying? If you're not used to going to the gym or you don't want to go to the gym or you don't feel like right about stepping into the gym, decluttering your house will get you where you want to be. And I'm telling you guys, if y'all saw my vlog yesterday where I was literally sweating, I was sweating for real. That was the real, the real, like, real deal. I was sweating. Like, if I can get a good sweat just doing all this stuff, and I didn't even have my AC on, so I was just feeling really good, you guys, and, like, I woke up this morning, and my whole body was, like, sore, like, freaking sore, and I'm at it again, so I'm staying motivated, and I just, you know, my trainer's been calling me and calling me, and I'm like, dude, <laughs> I gotta get this done, you know what I'm saying, I know you want me to come to gym, you know, you know, I want, I know you want me to meet you somewhere at the park or something like this so we can work out, but, dude, like, come on now, I have to get this done, like, I'm, I'm getting into my ab work, and I'm getting my leg workout in, I'm getting my arm workout in, like, dude, calm down, I'll be there next week, because I only got, what, two to three days before, you know, my whole decluttering week is over with, and I still got the kitchen, because, um, before the kitchen was looking clean now it's like packed full of dishes and stuff like that so I kind of got my system in there where I can start placing stuff or where I need to place it and then um putting what putting in the storage bins what I need to donate but anywho you guys <laughs> um it's been real you know what I'm saying like doing this whole decluttering thing it's been real real like stuff I haven't seen in like years probably you know what I mean and I'm just feeling really really good about it being at my condo and I'm glad to be home like I feel good like literally you just don't know like I feel calmer I feel peaceful I miss my son because he's at Nana's but I just have to do this on my own and I don't feel bad that he's not here. I just feel like when AJJ is around, nothing gets done. My son, he wants, like, my undivided attention. And I give it to him, 
But just, you know, I miss him so much. Like, he's at Nana's. But, um, yeah. Y'all know I love my baby. Like, I love my baby. But, um, yeah. And then, also, let me show you this. Girl, sis, look at this. Oh, um, sun stars and stuff. Bowls, little bowls. But you know what I'm going to do with these? I'm going to pack salads in these. Like, I'm going to start meal prepping. So, I'm going to pack some salad up in these things. I know that they're christmas -y, but look, it'll be okay. I'll find a label for them or something. But, I mean, these are, I'm telling you, I bought these probably about two years ago. <laughs> two years ago, sis. So, uh, you know, that's all I have to say. And, you know, I hope you guys are enjoying these decluttering stuff. Give us a thumbs up whenever you watch our vlogs. If you're able to watch our vlogs all the way through, give us a thumbs up because this really helps our vlog out. If you're new, hey, how you doing? I'm glad you're here. Comment below and let me know if you're a new subscriber. And I'll definitely reply back, you guys. I'm just trying to get my channel up to 500 subscribers or more um, before December 1st. So... I can only do that with you guys' help and social media. So, yes, you guys. Single mama trying to do it. She's trying to do it on the dime. Okay. I got to go. Bye.